Heel spurs. Here are some um, very basic exercises. You can use the 3D pain of heel spurs or plantar fasciitis. You can get a, a golf ball, a tennis ball. If you have a foam roller or muscle roller, that also will um, be very uh, beneficial. So to start with the golf ball, what you want to do, you want to uh, massage under the foot here using the golf ball. The range, uh, the zone where you're going to start from is behind the ball of the feet or the, of the foot, all the way to the front of the, of the heel. Don't get the golf ball directly on the heel or on the, the bones of the ball of the foot. So you're gonna place this on the floor. Okay, so let's put some friction, light pressure, then you pull the toes back, put a bit more pressure, really getting the golf ball into the plantar fascia to really loosen up that tissue. Now a lot of times in um, plantar fasciitis or heel spurs, um, they, you may also have some tight calf muscles. So you can stretch the calf muscles and also combine it with some massage. So I'll show you a calf stretch first. So a calf stretch, you just support yourself against a, a bed, a table, or, or the wall. What you want to do, you want to split both legs. So the calf muscle that's getting stretched here is the one behind. Put the heel on the floor. Heel is also on the floor. Keep his knee straight. You bend his knee while supporting yourself. Go forward. Notice when I'm going forward that the heels are still on the floor. I'm not letting the heel raise off the floor. That is wrong. Keep it on the floor. And you're not bouncing. There's no bounce. Okay, go forward, feel that stretch, then you ease out of it, then you switch, and you do the next calf muscle. Then you have the tennis ball, or you can also use a foam roller to massage the calf muscle. So what you do, you go get on the floor, like this. The tennis ball does not go into the, the crook of the knee. You put it just one third the way down. Either you support yourself on your palms or your knuckles, wherever you're more comfortable. Go back and forth, back and forth. Let the tennis ball massage the calf muscle. You may get some pain there when you roll over some tight spots or some quote-unquote knots. If, you, if you're on a knot to a trigger point, hold it right here, extra work. Keep the foot loose. Okay, so those are three basic exercises you can use to help to manage the pain of, of plantar fasciitis and heel, or heel spurs.